but you've got a face in a video of yours that you don't want showing up. In this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to blur out that face so that it's unrecognizable. So without any further ado, let's get to work. Hi, if you're new here, my name is Garrett Harding and I make DaVinci Resolve tutorials, all sorts of them. So if you're into anything related to post-processing and DaVinci Resolve, make sure you subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss any future uploads that are gonna help you learn the program and get better at video editing. Now that that's out of the way, I'm gonna show you exactly how to blur faces in DaVinci Resolve. So what you're gonna do is pop into the colors panel down here. We're gonna go ahead and grab a power window. We're gonna, we're gonna censor this guy right there. Yeah, the one that's in focus. So we're gonna grab a circle and we're gonna make it roughly the size of his face. We're gonna do like that. And then we're going to pop into our tracker. We're gonna turn off perspective 3D, rotate and tilt because we don't need them for this. Sometimes you might play around with them if your track looks weird, but in this case, we only need pan and zoom. So we're going to track that forward and then it gets caught on that guy's ear so we are going to go back to there. We're going to make a keyframe here. And then we're going to go until we can see our censored face again. We make a keyframe there and we're going to move it back onto the face. And then we're going to track it forward. Oh, I grabbed that guy again. All right. Well, let's find where this guy goes off screen like right there and then we'll just move this off screen we'll go to the next keyframe that it made we will move that off screen and then the next keyframe that it made oh. yep and then we will move that off screen and then if we play this that should stay on our guy's face Travels through that guy. Oh, ooh, we got a little bit off right there. Where do we leave it? Right, right around there. So we'll move it back on the face. Track forward. All right, and then it's gone. So let's check it. Stays on the face, moves through this guy, comes out, leaves the face. Quit leaving the face. go back to where it's on the face and then track it pause does it leave the face nope all right so we watch it back again and it stays on the face oh shoot quit quit picking new faces oh it didn't okay all right so now for the blurring part of this all right, so if you mess up like I did and you put that on your original node, go ahead and right click, go to add node, add serial before, and it will fix up your little issue. Because if you do the track and you only have one node, it's going to blur your whole thing. So, all right, blur. Just click on blur right here, drag that up, and it's blurred. But if we watch it, it's going to be blurred the whole time. And right there, we don't want it to be blurred. And then as soon as he pops back out, we do. So we put that there. So then if we go back, it's blurred. It's a beaut, just like that. And we're done. You just got to get the track on the face. Blur the track. Oh, we need to fix that. It's going down the whole time. So right about right there. We need to keep that radius all the way up until we get behind there. Yeah, like that. So now it'll be dark, dark. And then right about there, we should probably bring the radius up again. There you go. Blurred face. That's it. Just make sure that you keep
keyframe your blur radius when you go through stuff and make sure that you keyframe where your blur needs to be when you can't see the subject that needs to be blurred. All right, so that covers how to blur faces in DaVinci Resolve. Question of the day today, have you ever had to blur a face before? Did you do it like this or did you do it a different way? Or is this going to be your first time blurring a face? Let me know in the comments down below. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next video.